what is happening in Seattle's locker room, do you think, right now? Because Ian Rappaport, as I mentioned at the top of the hour, our colleague from the NFL media group is saying Cam's not returning this week. And the guy who replaced him fell down on a game-tying touchdown last week. And they're going into Green Bay this week. Okay. What Do you think Pete Carroll has an issue in that locker room, or there's enough paid professionals to just keep their heads screwed on straight? Uh, there are enough paid professionals. Uh, Cam has fallen down before in coverage. Cam has gotten beaten in coverage before. Uh, do the boys want Cam back? Yes, of course they want Cam back. Do they have an issue right now? No, because they have 15 more games. Now, if the, if the losses start to pile up, and especially if the losses start to pile up in the manner in which they lost this one. You lost a game in the Super Bowl, close one. Mm -hmm. That one play got away. You can look at this game versus the Rams and say that one play got away. If you go to Green Bay and the one play gets away, or the week after mm -hmm. that one play, then you start to say, wait a minute, we always won the close ones, now we're losing the close ones? That could be an issue. Right now, I don't think you have an issue. Um, again, do you want Cam in the fold? Yes. Um, from a player standpoint, of course you want him there, but I think there are guys on that team also that understand it from a business standpoint, that um, they see what the organization is doing. You can't because if you're gonna if you if you you're setting up a precedent that you're basically saying every time a guy has a good year, we're gonna give you more money. But didn't they move money from one year to another for Marshawn? Didn't they do that to um, get him to come into the fold last yes, year? Yes, and 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 which started this. They did that, but how many years did he have left on his deal? So now Cam wants to do it with with an extra year on the deal. True. So the next guy's gonna say, well, if you did it with Marshawn with one, now Cam with two, how about me with three? And that's what they're going to create. And when you have a team that has that many talented players on it, it's going to come around again. And it'll probably come around at the end of the season. So what do you think Cam's thinking right now? Is he really? Uh, I mean, this is this is now going to be a half million dollars that that's flushed down the, the toilet. Well, I... Unless they somehow, some way, excuse that. I don't know how that's possible. Or fine money. Well, or I guess they could, always, they could always excuse it because it's not like a league mandate. It's, mm -hmm. it's the team. So they can always excuse that. Uh... And this right here, I haven't had any conversations with Cam. I don't know Cam. Sure. Just I would just think that Cam is sticking to his guns from everything that I've heard, mm -hmm. that he feels that he has ground to stand on, and he wants to get that money moved, and he feels that his play has put him in position to ask for it. And that's all you can do as a player. All you can do is go out and just say, this is what I think I'm worth. This is what I, uh, what I put on film, yep. and I want to be paid for it so we'll see how it works out but i don't think that game really changes his position as far as the team is looking at the rich eisen show weekdays at noon eastern on audience